The overall goal of this synthetic procedure is to prepare functional insertion polynorburnines, which are highly functional polymers with a very high glass transition temperature. The main advantage of this technique is that it's possible to access high-performance polymers bearing highly reactive functional groups such as epoxy groups or acid groups via a simple experimental protocol. Generally, researchers that are new to catalytic polymer synthesis will struggle because the synthesis must be performed using very high standards of purity. But here, in a process we're going to describe, the synthesis can be performed easily with no special purification step. Demonstrating part of the procedure will be Mubarak Kampaure, a graduate student in the Claverie Laboratory. To begin this procedure, set up a one liter round bottom flask with a condenser and stir bar. Add 327 grams of acrylic acid and 4.9 grams of hydroquinone to the flask. Then, use a heating block to heat the mixture to 150 degrees Celsius. Once the refluxing has settled, add 300 grams of DCPD. Then, increase the temperature to 170 degrees Celsius for 16 hours. The solution color will change from clear to yellow-brown. Using a Pasteur pipette, extract a sample. Analyze by proton NMR using deuterated chloroform as the solvent. Next, remove the condenser from the round bottom flask. Replace it with the simple distillation setup connected to a condenser circulating cold water. Place the reaction setup under vacuum and set the pressure to one millimeter mercury.